12 best climbing flowers for pergolas and trellises. To celebrate the arrival of spring, let's talk about flowering vines. One of the more elegant ways to have in the garden is to add climbing plants or flowering vines. These plants can be trained to grow on structures such as trellis and pergola. Not only can it provide additional protection from the sun, they also provide a heady sweet smell that can be enjoyed until late spring. Number one, trumpet vine, Campsis, called the trumpet vine because of its gorgeous trumpet-shaped flowers. The flowers turn their color from orange to red and are yellow from its throat. Their distinct colors attract pollinators like bees and hummingbirds. The flowers need sunlight, but the leaves can grow well in shade too. Number two, clematis, surely one of the best pergola plants. Clematis is a spectacular vine as it blooms abundantly. Flowering usually starts from spring. You can grow it easily and combine with other plants, especially with climbing roses to get a more exquisite view. It tolerates most soil and sun conditions. Number three, wisteria. Wisteria is one of many favorite pergola climbing plants. But this fragrant beauty must have sturdy support. While purple may be the most recognizable color, wisteria also flowers in white, pink, and blue. Number four, honeysuckle, Lanicara. Honeysuckle is one of the perennial flowering vines that keeps its leaves throughout the winter in warmer climates and can produce its fragrant flowers well into the fall. Honeysuckle flowers have a nostalgic fragrance and become stronger as dusk sets. There are more than 180 different species and almost all of them are creepers. Number five, climbing rose. Many roses have climbing habits and are stunning on pergolas and trellises. As opposed to a bush type of rose, climbing roses not only use their thorns as protection, but also to attach and climb up things. The climbing rose comes in colors ranging from yellow to deep red with names such as Don Juan, Zephyrine Drohan, Zephyrine Drohan Rose, Joseph's Coat and Purity. Pair climbing roses with clematis and jasmine for a cottage, garden feel, Number six, chocolate vine, Achebea. This twining vine can grow 30 feet or more in height. It has compound leaves with five leaflets. The flowers are clustered in racemes and are chocolate, scented, with three or four sepals. The fruits are sausage, shaped pods which contain edible pulp. Number seven, star jasmine, Trachylospermum jasminoids. Surely, jasmine is the most intense flower. Its fragrance can be smelt from far, far away. So if you love fragrant plants, grow it. It is a top choice due to its ability to grow quickly, thrive when trained with other climbing plants, and sweet-scented blooms, which flower from midsummer to early fall. Number eight, bougainvillea. If you are looking for something bright and colorful in your garden, then bougainvillea must be your choice. The most frequent cultivated are the pink, red, yellow, and purple colors, but there are many other colors available. The best season for North America is fall or spring. It is mostly liked for its disease-resistant and pest-free qualities, which makes it popular among the garden lovers. Whether you plant it in a small pot or leave it to climb on a garden trellis or pergola, it will spread with full elegance overflowing the trellis and your arches. Number nine, sweet pea, lath iris. This plant offer fragrant blooms in multiple colors depending upon their species. It has delicate flowers and it looks beautiful in all types of garden structures. Make sure that you plant them in well-drained soil and in the sun. Sweet peas grow best in warm regions in fall and winter. 
If you are in a warmer temperature area, plant this beautiful, sweet smelling vine in the spring or summer. Number 10, Passiflora. Natives of tropical Americas, Asia, Amerasia, Australia, and the South Pacific, the genus includes more than 500 species, most of which are vines. Incorporating the passion flower or passiflower or passiflora in a residential backyard can give it an exotic feel. The heady fragrance, colorful flowers, and edible fruits make it one of most desirable climbing plant you can have in your garden. Combine passion flower with an early blooming clematis for a striking effect. Number 11, Morning Glory. Morning Glories most commonly produce a funnel-like flower that comes in a variety of colors. They appear in blue, red, purple, and yellow colors. This flower's bloom early in the morning and thus represents their name, Morning Glory. Number 12, Hydrangea. Hydrangeas typically appear as flowering shrubs, but this version climbs and features glossy green foliage with white flowers. This vine is rewarding because of its glossy heart-shaped foliage and its fragrant white flowers that appear in clusters during spring to summer. The plant is a slow grower and it needs training and pruning. 